100 years ago, Einstein announced his theory of gravity and is also known as general relativity. We live in four dimensional universe. That means three space dimensions and one time dimension. Three dimension means we can go side to side forwards and backwards and up and down. We do all this in time dimension. Time goes forward into the future. Space time that we live in isn't solid. It is dynamic. Dynamic means it can stretch, it can shrink, and it can curve in the presence of matter and energy. Einstein tensor. This whole thing is constant and T mu nu is stress energy tensor. G mu nu gives us shape of space time. T, T mu nu gives us how much mass and energy is there. The summary of Einstein's equation is matter tell space time to curve space time tells matter to move imagine this fabric as 2d space time when there's no matter or energy space time is flat when you put something heavy like moon moon makes little dip in space time when you put something heavier like Earth, Earth makes more dip than Moon in space-time. When you put something very heavy like Sun, it makes more, it makes more dip in space-time. But coal will make even bigger dip in space-time. Matter tells space-time how to curve. Space-time tells matter how to move. Imagine there's no Earth. This apple will just go in a straight line. Now I'll put Earth here. You can see that it curves space-time. Now this apple will not go in a straight line. It will follow curved space-time created by the Earth. This apple will move towards the Earth. Gravity is result of curved space-time created by mass. Planets are going around the sun because they are just following curved space-time created by the sun. Take two identical clocks. Put one clock near heavy mass, put another one far away from the heavy mass. According to Einstein's general relativity, the clock near the heavy mass ticks slower and the clock farther ticks faster. And this is called gravitational time dilation. When there's no mass or energy in space-time, light travels in a straight line like this. But when there's, a he when there's heavy mass like sun, it will bend light's path. And it looks like this. And this is called gravitational lensing. When heavy bodies like planets spin, they, they drag space-time along with it and this is called frame dragging. When this planet is frame dragging and this is how it looks like. Happy 100th anniversary to Einstein's general relativity. Thank you Mr. Albert Einstein. Yeah.
Yeah.